Remember the dead, fight for the living, the slogan for Workers' Memorial Day, the International Day of Remembrance and Action for Workers killed, disabled, injured or made unwell by their work. Dignitaries, politicians and officials gathered in the lobby of Parliament where a bugle sounded a minute's silence. In his address, the Chief Minister said it was the eighth year the day has been marked on the rock. The idea today that people might go to work and might never see their families again is totally anathema to us. And if there is one thing I am proud of over anything else in the time that I have been in government, we have had no deaths at work and not even any serious injury. That doesn't happen by accident. And every day we must be more vigilant and every day we must ensure that we do more so that tomorrow also is a day when people can safely go to work and their families can know that their relatives, their loved ones, will come home after a hard day's work. Fabian Picardo said it was no secret his own grandfather had died at work and called on the tradition of marking the day, started by his administration, to be adopted by every political party contesting the next election. In his message, the Chief Minister said his government was committed to protecting and promoting the rights of workers, adding he was proud to work year-round alongside Gibraltar's unions, even though he said they may not agree on everything. Unite Chairman Christian Duo praised the union's work in ensuring health and safety standards are met. Unite can be proud of the measures we are taking locally and our continued campaign in trying to achieve that adequate health and safety standards are met throughout the program. We need to unite health and safety representatives recognised by, employer, by employers both in the private and public sector. We need to make sure employers comply with the law ensured by strict government enforcement. We need adequate workplace health and safety policies in place both in the private and public sector. We need more qualified health and safety inspectors policing the industry. But above all, we need a safety protocol for all workers and Unite will give, not give up until our demands are met. Unite shall continue fighting for the living. Thank you all. Wreaths to honour all those who've lost their lives in the workplace were laid by the Governor, Chief Minister and representatives of local organisations such as the Royal Gibraltar Regiment and the Royal Gibraltar Police. Nothing should be taken for granted was the Chief Minister's message this year. He said we must protect those at work by remembering the dead to fight for the living.